Hello, everyone. This is Master Sam Loba coming at you with another Kindred Fates video. This time, I'm going to be talking about what I most want to see from the beta. We know the beta is going to be coming out sometime this year, or at least it is assumed and planned to be coming out sometime this year. And I thought now might be a, go a good time talk about what we could expect to see and what I would most want to see from the beta. So just to start things off with, I'm going to get the obvious out of here. I would love to see 2v2 combat. 2v2 combat's been talked about a lot and it, as far as I'm aware, is supposed to be in beta. I don't know if it's been 100% confirmed or not, but I'm putting this on my list. Number one, I want to see 2v2s. I think that that would shake up the meta significantly i think that even if we can add even if we don't add more kinfolk just the kinfolk we have right now would be more than enough to create a huge variety um even if you and your teammate played the exact four kinfolk as each other and went in like that like still the variety would be awesome of the kinfolk so that would be something I'm very much looking forward to is the 2v2s. Speaking of kinfolk, I would like to see more kinfolk. Now, since this is a, a wants and dreams video and not necessarily what's realistic, I'm going to say I want one new kinfolk of each type. Because that, as it stands, it's hard to tell exactly what a type plays like when you only have one example. Some examples are better than others. I think stuff like... Slifer does a pretty good job of showing you a null type. There's a lot of play styles he can go into. I think Shovelet shows you a really good earth type with stall. But then you have types like um, Lamala Hills, and it's really good support, but doesn't really show off buffing. Salamander is really good at combos, but doesn't really show off like the what I think a lot of people proceed as like using flows, flowing attacks, like a flowing river style type of attack because he's so slow and sluggish and everything. So seeing more stuff like that would be great. The roles I want to see the most, I want to see another Gaia type, I want to see another Water type, and I want to see another Dark type. I want the Gaia type to focus more heavily on minions, maybe have some minions that can actually do significant damage. I would love for the Water type to be faster and have uh, more of a flow to it. And I would love for the... Um, dark type to focus more on stuff like um debuffs well less on debuffs and more on the trickery side of dark type i want to see more about what being trickery is and if we could get some of those those are my favorite things that i'm most looking forward to seeing more of because i think most of the other things are more or less represented pretty well but those are the big three that I'm really looking forward to. All right, and speaking of three, number three, my third thing I want to see, <clears throat> I want to see more item variation. Because right now, you don't really get to pick between your items. Pretty much everybody runs almost the exact same items because that's just how it is. You get to choose between whether or not you want coffee bean, chrysanthemum, or... Um, aloe, and that is pretty much gambling on what your opponent is going to use. If you're going to use Skulkin or Ember, you want Coffee Meat, uh, you want Aloe or Scentidote, respectively. Using Black Mask, Black Mask really needs a re rework. Maybe that would be a good video for me to make. Because Black Mask is basically useless, even with Lumala being able to heal you. So, yeah, that's something I would love to see more item variation, some stuff that adds more cool stuff to your characters could have things that make it so you buff certain attacks at the cost. Maybe you have a thing that buffs all fire damage, but reduces all other types of income of damage you do. So you can only use fire moves, or maybe you take more damage from water type moves when you're using fire. Because the Kindred Fates uses types as an advantage, like as a play style, rather than just the Pokemon style. So maybe you get an item that adds that kind of Pokemon style in there just to give you even more gameplay variety. And then moving on to number four, wanted to make this uh, a nice round five, but I think we're going to go with four because this fourth one is a pretty big ask if I seriously doubt that it would even be added. But 
single player content and i don't mean the ai battle i mean like a world space maybe a handful of quests maybe one or two maybe three quests that we can engage with we can capture kinfolk in the wild even if it's only the kinfolk that are already in the game plus maybe whatever they add for the beta then to go in there to catch them to maybe have two or three quests that tell you go somewhere to give us an idea what the storytelling is going to look like to give us an idea what the world is going to look like and feel like and i know so many people ask about the alpha and beta and they're like is it single player is it single player and then they're always disappointed when they hear it's pvp you know that's completely understandable that um they're disappointed with being pvp the game's main thing is going to be the single player slash co-op and that is what a lot of people are most excited for the pvp community is small and i'm sure it's going to grow as we get the beta and eventually the full game but i seriously doubt that it's ever gonna you know take over the main focus of the game so um i would love to see at least a tiny tiny bit of the single player included but let me know in the comments below what you most want to see from the kindred fates beta it is promised as a combat arena beta very much like the alpha so like i said very unlikely we'll get single player but this is a hopes and dreams video so go wild with what you want to see just your, your biggest dreams and your biggest hopes for what the beta could be but until next time this has been monster of loba signing off hope you have a wonderful day goodbye god bless and i'll see you all in the next one Bye bye